these are my non-scoop items and i got a super scoop i'm so excited it was a whole story girl a lot the package was stolen i i believe the package was stolen <laughs> because the boxes are open and it wasn't in the parcel locker so and then it just showed up today in front of my door so i was like and it was already open so i was like okay i think somebody you know took it looked in it and was like nah this ain't what we want so they basically just dropped off back at my house but not before looking through everything because it was open like cut open so i'm so excited to have it thank you for whoever decided to bring my stuff back from the grace of god that they decided to go ahead and give it back to me welcome back to my channel my name is ashley aka pink uni budgets here on youtube tiktok and instagram and if you are new here hey girl how you doing i hope you're having a great day today so today i have a this or this and a little bit of this and a little bit of that unboxing from e nail couture i got a but these are the non-scoop items. This is stuff that I have purchased because I've wanted these spe specifically. So I got the French Extreme Square. I've been wanting these. I've been seeing them because they're so cute. And I'm not really good with my French tips yet. But I really wanted to do these. So it's like the three. So this is what they look like. You'll probably get a better look. Pretty thick. And they're so cute. This is not the, my size, but I love how they look too. And you could do different designs and everything. So that's what I got those ones. Then I got these tips are the maximum maximum stilettos. So these are the long stilettos. This is size nine. So let's see these ones. And I have a lot of of these gel tips, but I don't have any stilettos. So I don't know if that's a nine. It looks like a six, but it might be a nine. I don't know. It might be a six. Yeah. So these are the maximum stilettos. So they're pretty long. Can't wait to try those. And then these ones, I believe, they don't got a name on them, but these are almond tips. Because I know I got the long almond. Let me see. Whoops. Yeah, these are XXL stilettos. And then these ones are like almonds. I believe. So that's what they look like. If you can see them. So, I think they're a good length. Because I definitely want to do my nails. So my nails need to be done. Salon Almond. I like the little packaging and the little stars. So cute. So we got these ones, just like a five. So they're pretty good length and they're almond shaped too. So I like the almond shape because it makes my fingers look 
slimmer, <laughs> if that makes sense. Yeah, these are XXL stilettos. These almost look almost as long as the X, the maximum stilettos. No, they're pretty short. They might be like a little bit shorter. Like a little bit shorter. But they're still cute. I've been wanting to do stilettos for some reason. And then, oops, sorry. And then I got some toes. These are for, yep, the toe tips. I like how it comes like this because I got the other ones. But I like how it comes like in the little things because it'll be so much more easier to kind of just press it on your toes and then just like break it off that way. So these just make it a little bit more easier for me to do my toes. And I like the box too. And what's this? This I don't remember getting. Because, you know, when somebody took my stuff, they didn't leave my, um, <laughs> they didn't bring my, um, well, they took my little paper where it has all the stuff that you got. Yeah, they took that. So, I have absolutely no idea. <laughs> but I don't think I got this. I think this might have been a freebie. Because this is a no, soft nail extensions pro box. And it's like plastic. So those would be nice for my long toes. And then I got this. I wanted one of these because I was doing my girlfriend's grandma's nails the other day. And she didn't have nothing to put her hand on. So it was kind of hard manipulating her hand. But this she could rest her hand. And they say you can even like do your nails like that. I saw somebody say you could do it like that. And I don't know what's in the super scoop, so I wanted to make sure I got what I wanted. And got two more things. Put this box down. And we're going to zoom in just a little bit. Okay, so. Got the little armrest. I really like that. And then I need these. Because I use the Jello Jello Peel Off Base Coat. And the, they always use the orange sticks. So the orange sticks actually make it a lot easier. It makes it a lot easier to take off the nail polish and the gel. And of course, I got an apron because all that dust kept going on my clothes, and I was just so over it. So this is so cute. It's a cute, nice quality apron. They got some pockets. Can't wait to wear that. So, these are all the items that I got in my non scoop. And of course, I got nail tips, which is, but these are the nail tips that I actually wanted. Like, it was a big thing for me to get what I want. Let me make sure I get some light. So, I got these, which is so cute. Let me zoom out a little bit. There we go. Give you some room to breathe. And I'm gonna put these to the side. And then we're gonna get into our scoops. I can't wait. I cannot wait for the scoops. This is like the mystery of all. So, boop -ba -dum. all right, I'll zoom out.
I'm trying to zoom out. Hold on. There we go. All right, so we got a super scoop and a nice big box. So this is like first impressions. First impressions. What do y'all think? I was, when I first, oh sorry, I keep knocking this to the side. My bad. When I first saw it, I was like, oh, what is this? <laughs> Like, I'm so excited to have this to practice on your nails. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so let me go ahead and put this down, and we're going to go through it. So we got a hand, a practice hand, which I am so excited. And it even has, like, where you can screw it onto your desk. I'm so excited, y'all. This is really going to help. I'm like missing a little nail piece right here. But I think these just pop off. Yep. They pop off. And you can practice like laying acrylic. Or however you want to do it. So that's going to help a lot. I love that. We got some of these foils. I'm not really good with foils. I don't know, maybe it's just my technique that I'm using them, but these are really pretty. Like, I like how this one looks. That's pretty. Uh, I'm trying to wheel it back in there, wheel it back. Come on, wheel it back in there. Those are pretty. I like the sparkles on these. Because I think I tried to do like a full nail of these and I completely messed up. <laughs> so I'm still trying to figure out how to really use these. Like this is so pretty. I like the holographics. The holograph, the hologram. Got some more. These are super cute. Look at that. I love this one because it has like the pink and the roses on there and has like the snake skin. And then these ones, they look like they're tightly wound. Like these are pretty cute. It would be cute to do some like butterfly nails or not butterfly. What am I trying to think? The bumblebee. And they're really thin. So I kind of want to try those. So that's a cute, very cute. let's see we got some round tips we got the what is this called eternal beige almond okay, beige almond and then honey peach almond so i guess there's like a different tone to them yeah this one's more like have a pinky hue this one's more of a peachy hue yeah if you can see the different colors. I want to see if somebody use these. Let's see. And then these are the mini stilettos. Which I will love those. So let's keep moving. My candy box. I think you use these for like your brushes. Like your brushes and your files. super cute i love it because you can put more stuff on here like on the top and on the bottom my candy box and then you have the puffy oh these are cute to do in like um ombre ombre nails boop, boop, boop. Boop, boop, boop. they're nice and soft they all look like they're kind of like the same. None of them looks like ice cream cones. Like these ones are flat. Definitely wait. can't wait to do some designs with those. And there's also some directions too. And how to do designs. Yay, I can't wait to do those. I definitely want to do a um a nail design 
just using email couture. Okay, so we got some extra nails. That's gonna come in handy. And now we got, oh, I think this is, I think it's monomer. <laughs> I think this is monomer. Cause it's liquidy. Yes. This is the best in the world pink magic monomer. And it is made in America. So of course it's halfway full. Cause everything in America is halfway full. <laughs> halfway full. So but nothing spilled out or anything. Okay, let's see. Ooh. I've always wanted one of these. These are super cute and it has like the the I'm sorry, I got some stuff stuck on my the balls on there, like the gold one, the gold balls that I've been wanting to have. Cause you can make like the cutest design. You can take a very simple design and make it like extravagant by just using these little gold balls. So very happy about those. Got some goodies. Then we got a nail brush. Definitely. Oh, that's so nice. So you can clean right under your nails. And scrub. And they're very... Did you hear that? Like, they're very stiff. So they'll really get in there and clean. And then I got a 2020 nail file. And then I got some of these already, but you can never have enough. Because these are really good quality. I used those when I tried to do the foils. This is cute. Look at that. I could play with that all day. Oh, see? It's so poking out. I don't want it to drip on my thing, but... It's cute. I love the concept of them. Very cute. So we got that one. I know you can use these with gel. It's nice and stiff. But I usually use these when I'm doing like my when I'm dealing with gel. Sorry if you hear the noise in the background. Baby's on her phone. And we got Oh, I love these the size 16s. I do use size 16s because my nails are, I usually do longer nails, long nails. And I love that. I love the glitter. The pink is so cute. Let's see what these ones are. Super cute. I don't think this one. Oh, I think the. Yeah. It leaked out. Boo. Yeah. I could always just put some oil in there. But this is another brush for gel or cleaning. You could use this brush for cleaning. I'm trying to get it out. Yeah. You could use this brush for like cleaning up like mistakes or anything. But the little oil thing is out. <laughs> it's not in there no more. And then we have some of these. Let's see what these ones are. Oh, we got an ombre brush. Which will come nice and handy if you like doing ombre. Love that. And we got another ombre brush. So these will come nice and handy. And we keep on going. Okay, let me see. We got a bright pink acrylic. Bright pink acrylic. Ooh, that is so pretty. Definitely can't wait to swatch that. Okay, 
we got a glass bowl so basically with this you can start doing nails right away like this will be a very good value all for 60 dollars like you can't beat it because you got your this is so cute i have one just like this because i love this so much i'm glad i have another one so happy i have another one they're so cute Let's see what's this what is this Let's see. Uh -huh. oh it looks like these are some okay there they are like some big clippers for when you do your like to get like the big stones off stone clippers Definitely gonna use those. I'll put that out. Ooh. And we have some brush wipes. They're nice and thick. Nice and thick, too. I like those. I like those. Those little brush wipes. Put that to there. Ooh, and we have some maxi wet wipes multiple use moist cleaning wipes for nails and makeup removal so these would be nice to use because i always see like like juni nail or shuni nail use like wipes and stuff oh dang i forgot see look i only took a piece of it out okay so they're about that big yay big do they fold out or is that as big as they go oh they do fold out or that i just grabbed two Whoops. but these would be these would be really nice like if you want to just like clean up however you use it like cleaning up space Cleaning out under the nails. I think that'll be cool. Cool. Let's see. I used to have some nail care brush wipes. I think these are like the bigger ones. Ooh. And they are nice and thick too. So you can kind of get a gauge on size oh look at this what's this it's a cup this is cute it comes with like a little glass cup plastic thing oh this is super cute oh you know this is gonna be my favorite cup Look at that. And it has like little glitters and everything on there. That's so cute. It's cute. <laughs> I just wanted to look because that's not going to fit right there. But that's super cute. It'll be a nice cup. Like, this would be my favorite cup. I love that. That's super cute. Alrighty. Oh. Oh, and I got another one. Okay, cool. I could definitely use a backup. I'm going to keep it in here. So, I'm going to keep this as a backup. In case that one gets like super dirty, you know. So now I have extra. Ooh. What's this? Happy Gel Grand Champion White. Let's see what that one is. Grand Champion White. 
It looks like poly gel. And it looks like it's a white color. Oh, yep. Oh, yeah, it's super thick, too. I will really use that if I want to do white, all white nails with some designs with hearts and all types of stuff. Okay. Uh, let's see. Oh, I was already. Ooh, it's a sticker book. Definitely love that. Like that is so nice. So you could put all your stickers in here. Cause I definitely need this too. Cause I got some stickers in the box too. So I got these white stickers with little the white designs. And then I got some little ones with butterflies. It's so cute. So let's see, they go in here. Boop, boop, boop. I'm just dropping everything. Let's see if they fit. Yep. Oh, that is cute. Let me get this. like we got some nail remover cotton nail remover cotton i love this sticker book we got some nail remover cotton it says polish with a nail file to remove a layer of gel polish from the nail till the nail tear the nail remover and apply it to the nail and wrap sides and bottoms tightly and wait 10 minutes to remove Ooh, let's see. A special nail remover for gel polish. It looks like it's. I don't know how to open it. Cause it looks like it's. Oh. Cause I want to try it on one of my fingers. Like I wonder if I'm supposed to like keep it. It was very strong, like super strong. But I think you're supposed to keep it in there, but let's see. Okay. I'm excited. I needed to see somebody actually like use these to see how you're supposed to use them correctly. Because I know you're supposed to use, do it somehow. But it is very strong. Okay. Keep that on there. Yeah, it's supposed to remove the the gel. It's supposed to wrap it around your finger, but I don't know exactly how to wrap it around your finger. So let's see. Let's move on. Okay, so we got some Grand Champion, and it says Biscuit Pink, Glow in the Dark. Ooh. So we got some more acrylic, 
and these grow grow <laughs> glow in the dark biscuit pink that's really pretty color I'm very tempted to use these tools and see how they swatch and then we have grand champion It looks like a white, but I could be wrong, but it looks like a white. Like, I wish this was more engraved in there, because I don't want to lose it. Like, I don't want to lose the sticker. I might have to just tape it on there. Cause I like this better than this one. Yeah, I think I like this packaging more. So put that side. Looks like we got some glue, nail glue. Little thing of nail glue, always good to have in your purse, always at all times. And we got some nail. Oh. Is this more poly gel? Oh, damn. The thing fell off my finger. But it looks like it it lifted some of it. So it's kind of easy to peel off. So I would say that those work. Because it's peeling off. It peeled off. Okay. So this Grand Champion one. Yeah, this one I already did. Okay. What's this? It's a box. Oh, it's a little nail. It's like one of them little fingernail lamps. Cause I have so many lamps. But this is good to have on the go. And has like little instructions. We'll try to use it when I do my nails. Which will be coming up later. And now... I'm trying to gather all, I think I got all the, oops. ooh, all the gel. Let's see, I got some gel, gel, gel. Ooh, super rich liner gel. Oh, and I think I got a little stick, a little orange wood stick. And then we got some gel polish. Ooh, that one looks pretty. These all look pretty. It's a shiny star top coat. I like how it has like all the little symbols on the, uh, all over it. Oh, whoops. Let me see if it'll, it looks like it has glitter in it. I'm trying to get it out. Get it out. Get it out. Because this thing is on here. Like, I am not surprised that this thing popped off just a little bit. Ooh, that thing is tough. Tough as nails to get out. Okay. Uh, I think there's like a stopper. Because it's so hard. Oh my gosh. I was like, I'm just going to have to figure this one out. Because oh. really, it looks like it has really nice silver glitter in it. But it also looks like there's something that's stuck in there too. So I'm just trying to try to figure out how to put it back in there. <laughs> Hold on. Dang. I finally got on there. It looks pretty. But I'm not really a fan of that, um, the cap or like the top. It got stuck. But look at this one. This is a pretty color. I don't know what, what it's called. Ooh, it's very 
very pretty. It looks like a green, like a dark green to me on this side. Like a nice dark green. Yeah, it looks pretty. Uh, I'm just like putting stuff on my nails. <laughs> well, that's why I got these. Boop. I don't know if they're magnetic or not, but. Ooh, and this one's pretty too. I like these bottles a lot more. The gel isn't super thick. This one's really pretty. And it looks like... So that one looks actually really pretty if you're doing something for like St. Patrick's Day. Or if you're doing like a spring set of nails. I'm trying to see if you can see. So some of the parts was blurry, so I wanted to show you guys what this one kind of looks like. So it's a very pretty yellow. I got a lot of spring colors. So I hope you guys can see. Oh, come on. It doesn't want to focus. We got some holographic colors. This one's really pretty. It's like a light green glitter. What else did I do? Hold on. I think I did this pink too. So pretty. I love this color pink. Like it has really good payoff. Doesn't want to focus. It's a really color, pretty pink. And then we have a lot of silver glitter. This one is like. Silver glitter. And we'll focus on that one. I think it's. This one is kind of hard to see, but it's like such a pretty. Galaxy color. Cause now that I put it on my nail, it looks like a dark forest green. Let's see this this one yeah 204 very pretty I think this is yeah 143 for the gold like the yellow gold one this one didn't have a name under it 141 for this light green 132 for this light, light green glitter. 129 for the silver. All right, there we go. Cause I was having, I redid this. So just to make sure you guys can see it. That's very important. I was like, why am I out of frame? I hope I wasn't out of frame through that whole thing. But, all right, you guys, I will see y'all later. Stay tuned. I'm going to go ahead and do my nails. And I'm, I want to use some of all of his products to do my nails. And we'll see what we come up with. So I will see y'all later. Bye.